One of the things I really enjoy doing is just going up to somebody with Incomplete, because they know that the trips to Africa are there, and just say, hey, would you like to go to, would you like to, go to Africa? And they kind of first are like, well, uh, I, that sounds like an amazing opportunity, but I don't, going to Africa is a big deal. But I just like to challenge people, because once they kind of settle in and they get over their anxiety of it, going down there, there's nothing I can say on this film that can explain the feeling that you get and the change in your life that happens when you go to Africa and come back. The only way to experience is actually going. Now imagine living in a place where you don't have access to clean water. You don't have ability to do all those things that you like to do, or you have to go a kilometer or a mile or two miles to even get a five gallon bucket of water. Imagine what life would be like without clean water. Water is life. Now imagine having to go to get water in a, in a cattle pond, and you've got all these problems that are along with that. You've got waterborne diseases like typhoid or dysentery that you're fighting constantly. You're constantly sick. When we put a water well in Africa, it changes the life of that community. It changes the life of that region. It changes the life of generations to come. Today we visited an orphanage. God is gracious. When Mama Yada looks over the children of Togo, West Africa, whose families have since been separated due to life's toughest battles, the loss of a parent, mental illness, and violent conditions, one can only feel a sense of purpose and meaning. I mean, it was going down a dirt road, and even when you look around here, it's like wide open spaces but all of the 100,000 people that are in this area depend upon this location for simple things like, for instance, their number one drug that they give out, ibuprofen. That is something that's really impactful when you look at how you're, inf you're affecting all of these people within this area. And it's only gonna start growing. asked the midwife about her favorite story, and her favorite story was the first birth that they had here, and how she was not only able to save the mother's, but the child's life. An enfant est né, et une autre occasion de s'épanouir est donnée. The access for sons, daughters, mothers, fathers, family, not by blood, but by the connection and the needs of one another. To give in return, you receive purpose. It's always good to go and help others and do good. But the reality is when people go, and we send people from complete, when they go down and they come back, one thing that they don't ever expect is what's gonna change in them. This is amazing. You got you, you gotta go here. Um, if you have ever a chance. 